Welcome to Ooblets. I actually did start this before, and I messed up the recording by trying to change into the sound, which on the recording, it was fine. So I actually lowered it. <laughs> I lowered it and made it worse. Alright. Let's try to choose something more dude-like. That'll be fine. Not very much options here. Oh, because I didn't actually choose a color. Alright. What should we look like, guys? Probably just gonna go with a sweater. I feel good. Let's go. Your life has been a giant too. So far, you spent all that 2D life on the ice of the Aro Island, where the people are stuffy and there aren't even any duplicates. That's why you've decided to leave. You're off to the distant shores of Manland Oop. Theodore. A place you've only heard vague tales of. A fabled land of oddity, creativity, and... Title drop. Ooblets. Oh, Biddly Boy. Are you from the Ooblet High Council? Is this a surprise inspection? Did I fail? Uh, no, I'm Crispy from Aro Island. Oh, then how do? Welcome to Badge Town. My name is Tinsel. Oh, and I'm the mayor. What can I help you with? I'm looking to start a new life somewhere, possibly here. Splenda. Are you looking to buy a house? Maybe invest in the local economy? Well, I have no money or skills or personal possessions. That accurate. Uh, a true entrepreneur, then. I can work with this, though. Yeah, I've been needing a helper for my ever-expanding merry old task list. And there's an old abandoned farmhouse. You can have it if you help me with all the junk I gotta do around here. You in? Free houses don't just get offered every day. I'm in. What can I help you with? First. Fantastic. First off, we, right, where are your oblets? Ooblets. I don't have any. They don't have ooblets where I'm from. Huh? Not even an Oogum? It's going to be tough to do much with, without ooblets here. Well, your local ooblet club will probably give you one. What ooblet club are you in? Um, we don't have ooblet clubs where I'm from either. What sort of... Ugh. No bother. You can join one here. Let me fetch our local club leaders. You can introduce yourself to some townsfolk in the meantime. Digging your whole dilly you got going on. Very confused chick. I'm crispy. I'm crispy. I'm new here. My favorite type of person, one I don't know yet. I'm Ara. I'm Alu. I saw your boat pulling. So are you some sort of rich tourist come to buy a postcard and novelty t-shirts? No, I'm crispy. I'll be I'm looking to start a new life here. Oh, blah. what am I supposed to do with all these novelty t-shirts? Bird and lump stump. Noob with spotted. You're standing awfully close to me. Oh, I'm Crispy and I'm new in town. I suppose you'll be wanting to know my name now, huh? That's okay, you can tell me when you're ready. Okay, fine. I'm Charles. I'll make clothes at my shop, Kibon Bon. I'd shake your hand, but I don't do that. So you won't shake my hand, is what you're saying. Wiggly Whip. Are you the researchers that I requested three years ago? No, I'm just new here. I'm Crispy. Introduction. Okay, sure. I'm Magnolia, and I operate the Lunary. It serves a variety of purposes. It's too complicated to get into right now. If you're going to be sticking around, you should have this. Okay, cool. Uh, the Grumboir. Gimme. Keeps track of all your tasks. Items, friends, that sort of things. How does it do all that? Science and magic junk. You'll figure it all out. Or you won't. I have no match for your aptitude for these sorts of things. We'll look more into that a little bit. Taffy do, yes, it's true. Okay, then I'm crispy. Go away now. Rude. Howdy doody. Looking for a bun? 
I don't think so. I'm just moving to town. Oh, huh? To Batch Town? Well, I'm pulled. Local Bungle delivery fellow. Here's a little gift from the Bungle Bee Company to welcome you to town. Uh, and it got Bungle Bee Gum Bun. Gives you energy. Let's find us prepackaged tree bees into them. Eat Bungle Bee Buns for a quick and easy boost to your energy and mood. Probably. Howdy do, dearie. My number's not up, is it? I'm Crispy. I'm moving to the old farmhouse. Oh, good. I'm Mead. And I run the little gardening shop here, so I guess we'll be seeing a lot of each other. If you have any spare produce, you can sell it to me. And if anyone starts asking too many questions, tell me first. Suspicious. Oh, customer, what can I get you? Bean juice? Spicy? Sorry, I don't actually have any money. Not winning customer of the month so far. Well, when you do scrounge up some money, spend it here at Cuddle Cups. I'm double, and I serve the best only bean juice in town. Splenda, everyone's here now. So basically, Ublik Clubs are little social groups that each have their own themes and personalities. These are our local Ublik Club leaders, so I thought I'd let, you, let them each give you a quick pitch to see what they're about. We'd love to have you join Fun Buns, we're delightful, a club for sweet cuties who love cute things. Uh, peak snubs don't do pitches, you should be pitching to me. The club of born leaders, strong competitors, and just generally successful people. I don't really know what to say about my nippins or what to do with my hands. Uh, the club for clever people who aren't very good at social interactions. And if you like adventure, the outdoors, and nature, you should join me at Moss Sprouts. Now the club for a woodsy outdoor type who love good adventure. And that's all of them. Well, I think this is the most accurate about me. Uh, maybe not the clever part, but the social interactions part for sure. So we'll join the Mippins. Yep. This is basically pick Mippins, but hopefully you'll be satisfied with your choice. I've chosen an Ubla for you that I've predicted will be an acceptable companion. Little Robo Boy. Aw, you two look a perfect match. And there they go, trotting away. Now that you've gotten a nublet, you should try getting into a dance-off. Ooblets are mysterious creatures and they apparently love dancing. It's very important to them. All we can do is support their interests and set up an elaborate contrived competitive dance scenarios for them to show off in. You'll be amazed at the sort of conflicts that get resolved through the medium of dance. Oh, here comes a word they can better let you practice. A little head side to side head bobs. Uh, dance challenge from Lump Stump? Yes. Here's where you pick which Ublet you want to dance. You only have one so far, it's not so it's an easy choice. Oops, no. Uh play next move twice. So I can earn four points, or I can just go straight up and earn seven points. Uh each turn, uh random dance moves or you have random dance moves to choose from. Some basic moves that will always be available. Each Ublet has its own unique move. With some experience, they can learn new moves. Uh, moves cost beats and you get fresh beats used every turn. To start with, you'll draw four moves and have three beats per turn. Some moves increase your points, lower your opponents, or do other junk. The goal is to get to this number, points for your opponent. Um, seems best just to do this. If I, even if I double the next card, it's only six. In turn. Oh wow, they go. Uh, play next move twice, earn four points, that'd be eight points. Let's do this. I wish you could cue them up. And then, woo, eight. Oh, twice, gotcha. Five more points to win. Well, this is giving me this gives me four. And this gives me two. So if we do this, and then this, that will get us actually to twenty-one. And if we hit twenty, we win. Uh, get seed from Lumpsum? Sure. Good job, little Sump. You did great. And he pooped out a seed for us. That made to grow a new friend. 
Easy peasy. Anywho, you should head to the farmhouse now and get settled in. Uh, new loot spotted. Flibble. Flubble. Flubbelly? House! Asterisk. I love how there's water dripping off it, even though it's light out. It's not much right now, but what do you expect for a free house? I'm sure you'll be able to fix it up and make it real pretty. Maybe add some bunting. Bunting always helps. Wow, what a junkyard. I mean, a very unique property with a lot of potential. I brought you a couple things to get you started with your farm. Uh, three sweetie beetie seeds. Sweet root vegetable, which can be used to create fructose. Takes three days. Basic scraper. Give it a shot. Just don't dig deeper than six feet down anywhere around here. Strange. Okay. So, it says to use the arrow keys, but you move around with waz and everything like that. That's very inconvenient. Can I? Oh, one, two, okay. I did miss that last time. And then we'll... Nope, nope. There we go. Hello. Uh, a little splinter. Now you just need to water it. Here's a dribbly can you can use. <laughs> Gimme. Hello. Uh, fill it with water from the tap here and then use it to water your seeds. Actually, before we continue, let's look this and plant that. There we go. Hello. You got it, and all you have to do is water the crops each day and harvest them once they're fully grown. You've already a pro of farming, maybe semi pro. You'll improve. Anywho, you must be pretty tired, so get some rest, and I'll check in on you tomorrow morning. And off they go. Let's go ahead and... I assume... Yeah, I can't do anything else. Okay. In we go. And let us sleep. Now starts a new day. Actions like watering use up your energy. You can see how much energy you have here. Uh, you can get energy back by sleeping, drinking bean juice, and eating certain foods. I do wish this was more of a number and not a bar. Alright, let's go ahead and refill this back up. I already know I'm going to need some of this stuff. So let's get off that. There we go. You get a nerny. Precious little bits. Uh, tiny bits of wood. From a blanket. Um, one thing that's a good second for me to realize is like all these random things that fall out are just nernies. They're not separate items. And you will need a lot of this stuff. And the faster I get some of this stuff done, um, I'm going to have to collect blankets and nernies for other stuff. This is effectively as far as I made it. I started some of the quest, but I didn't really get anything done. What's annoying is every single time I'm breaking one of these, I have to spam the button. You have to do it, spam it three times in order to break something. You earn a new badge. Here it comes. I'm already tired. 
Uh, Hopdob, you earned your first badge. We're all about badges here, so hoping we'll be awarding you with a bunch more. Check your Grumbar for what other badges you can get. Thanks, Tinsel. I like the idea that we just say thank Tinsel right there. Not not that they heard it. Collect uh, 60 forgeables. Forgible, uh, some sort of token. 40 wishy. Alright, so let's go into our tab here. Actually, first things first, let me get out of that. And let's... Can I use these? I don't know if I can actually use these from my inventory. No, get out of that. Alright, let's go in here then. It's 40 energy. Just consume some of these. I don't know if I should hold on to those or not. But I have other stuff I need to do, so let's get started. Is there a way to watermark my jokes so people stop stealing them? Jokes are meant to be shared. Sure, it's annoying when somebody repeats your joke and they say it better than you, but... I'm terrible at delivery. Uh, Crumberry. A nice sweet berry. Contains four energy. I don't know if I should be cleaning up the town or not. not that takes a lot of energy to do that. A fancy mushroom. Forgus. Uh, a quid. Spiky and sweet. Contains three energy. Wait, there was three there. Why did I only get two? A button boy. Fatty mushroom. Can be used in soups and things. Contains three energy. Kiaffy. I like Kiaffy. Uh, help Tinsel with this task. Get you access to the task board. Let's do it. Nice, you found the town again. Probably noticed my open office layout, and that's it. Cardboard boxes. Turns out an aggressive little clicky claws has made Town Hall its home. Every time I try to go in, it starts biting my ankles. I guess they voted for the other guy. Maybe if you make a big show of beating him in a dance battle, it'll be enough to get them to leave so I can start using my office. Be prepared, they're right on the other side of this door. Let's dance. For those are just turning in, uh, dancing's actually not too bad here. It's not like the little a little showy thing. You actually do dance challenge. You click your balls. Click mine, and let's go. So it's actually a card battle system, even. Alright, we'll do next move twice. Perform. There we go. Four points. So our goal is to get the 20 before they get the 20. That's it. Eat in turn. Same thing, actually. There's something relaxing to play. Add a move to your hand. Oh. Alright, and this will finish us up. We have beat the clicky claws in the dance challenge. That's that's what I basically look like dancing. Is that key earned? 40 points. Get a seed from clicky claws? Sure! And good job, Clicky Claws, you did great. Like I, I can't believe they made them poop out seeds effectively. You can do it. Totally had to come to terms with the permanence of my cardboard outdoor office. Now that I can use Town Hall, we can get started on all the projects I have planned to save Badge Town. It's quest time. Here's what I'm thinking. Did you actively write them? Fix the friendship sticker printing press. Repair the old farmhouse. Help Brignolia start her Ooblet research product and reconstitute all the mystery cans. I know there's a lot to do, so we should probably start with some of the easier ones. First thing you should do is fix up your house. It's a bit of an eyesore. 
You can also see what else needs to be done by walking around town. Anywho, I'll be moving to my new office here if you need me. Complete. Reopen town hall. Yay. Okay. We got a lot of people to talk to, but first things first. I actually want to run back to my farm. I don't like I, I don't like having not being able to run. I don't know if later on there's a reason you can't sprint all the time, but having to break up your sprint just to actually I don't even know. Um let's uh put that I keep trying to click and then drag, it's actually or uh like hold and drag, it's actually you just click these things and move them. Easy enough. I forgot what I was saying something I already forgot. Alright, let's plant this. Oh, I, I hate that my run is based off of like even my total energy. As you see, I don't have a full run bar. I don't know if that's gonna come into play later or not. It took me way too long to figure this out. To figure this out, so you might not know yet. You can find nernies and rocks laying around on your farm. That's where you get them. Here are a couple I've already found. Of course, I you saw I, I have plenty now. Uh, I guess I don't town by fixing your musty, decrepit shack. It's a less terrible shack. Need 12 blankets, 8 nernies, and 5 clothlet, which we have no clothlet yet. Deposit all that we have, and we're good to go for right now. Okay. The easier one to do. Oh, what do you got? I'm going to turn this down to something amazing like ice cream sundae for dinner of towns. Oh, you're still here? Uh, if you're sticking around, you should get on my good side. It might come in handy. And these are the mystery cans that they were talking about. Where's all the trash even coming from? Oh, hey, how's the Grumbar working out for you? No one's scheduled explosions, I take it. Grumbar? That magic book thingy I gave you. It's called a Grumbar. Oh, the, so that. So far, it's been pretty useful, but also inert. Good, good. I'm nearly certain it will stay that way. Inert is good. There we go. That's all the mystery cans. Hopefully. Wait, can I dance off? Again, their dance demands four blankets. Sure. I've actually this is the, this would be my first time challenging them outside of like the story stuff. What level is he? Flea battle? You actually have a flea option? Oh man, that's um increases the power of dance moves. Add a move to your hand. Or just earn seven points. Let's just earn seven points. That's, that's, oh, that's a little over a third of what we need, so can't pass up that. We just earn one point. And move to your hand, gain a beat. Still three points. Gain one hype. Uh, let's gain a hype. I to move to our hand, which... Um, uh, no, I can't. It doesn't matter, does it? No. This is where your hype is right here, but I don't know how that works. Well, in turn. Gain three points and one hype. And then earn two points. Oh no, they're beating me. What do we got? What do we got? Um, still four points. Um, yeah, let's just do that. That will separate us by a factor of eight. And that's all I can do for this turn. Ugh. Ugh. <sighs> all right. So what do we got? Play the next move twice and earn five points. That'll do it. One time and two times. Good. 
you win. So does it matter that there were four of them against me? Oh wow, 40 XP, so I leveled up. Do 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 do. All right, Echo, or Ego, excuse me. Uh, Psychic, you got a new move. Uh, stun target for two turns. Jesus, that seems a little broken. Sure, we'll take a seat. Good job, little lumps up. You did great. I'm not gonna get over that. That's ridiculous. Sure, so there's a reason not to take the seed. Uh, clear it all in mystery can. Okay, let's do it. What's this? Uh, please do not lick the reconstitutor. I wasn't about to do anything like that. Apologies, we had some prior issues with invalid reconstitutor inputs. What is the reconstitutor? It's a machine that transfers, it transforms a variety of things into slurry. So slurry can be processed into seed dangle bait. Seed dangle bait? Surely you must know seed dangling. Sea dangling? So when you put stuff on a string and dangle that string into the sea. So fishing. To catch things. Look, there's, thing dangling. there's a seed dangling spot right over there. Try it yourself, it's very simple. Even for you. Here's some bait. Basic bait. Okay. I actually Oh. Uh try using the seed dangler to see what it's all about. Okay. Choose your bait. And cast. I didn't have to press anything, that automatically happened. Okay, you got a speed grow. And then we're mm. back over here. See, dangling, very straightforward. If you collect any mystery cans, be sure to put them in this reconstitutor to get more bait. Mm. And again, do not look the reconstitutor. Okay. So let's uh, try to put in all those cans we got. Oh, uh, that's it. All we can do is, what, 4 times 3, so 12 at a time? We'll just let that go for a minute. Had yeah, to walk all the way around. What's the best sort of camera for, pho for photographing ghosts? But, oh, is there no answer? Uh, what do people do with these shells? Uh, gastro glob. Beautiful sea swirl. Uh, my newsletter is just a, it's just me asking people if they want to hang out. Kinda sad. Uh, Shelbo, uh, pretty good from the sea. Uh, sea plop came from the ocean. Nope, oh, come on. There we go. Do you have anything to say? That's it. Are there people who can read in their head without reading out loud? Yes, there are. Though that's not what I'm doing right now. Uh, it's only supposed to be acceptable to ask someone how business is going if you're a shareholder in a shareholder meeting. That's just kind of rude. Oh, I am low on energy. We're just going to probably eat, end up eating all these. down to 10. So, let's put these last two cans in here. Oh no, you're up to 10, excuse me. We got a basic bait. And we reconstituted all the mystery cans. Yay! That means we can also go fish again, can't we? Oh, quote unquote fish. Basic bait, and cast. Got a gummy. Oh, I can't do it again. Fair enough. Uh, gleamies are just like normal ooblets, but I need them. Okay. 
Why is that bench glowy? Look, the incident remains unalerted to the presence. Operations continuing as planned. Operative. That's weird. Uh, recipe piece. Be it paper with some bit of recipe on it. Oh, wow. Ah! Ah! Uh, no. Initial contact made with the uh, Ubinoid variant. What variant designation are you? Huh? Your name by local standards. Oh, I'm Crispy. Ubinoid variant Crispy. Noted. You may refer to me as Vidian. Hi, I guess? I agree. Melda? Oh, hi again. We never got properly introduced. I'm Melda, the Front Buns Club leader. Hi, Melda. I'm Crispy. Uh, very cute name. Welcome to town. So this is the bean juice place, right? For energy? Total Cups Cafe. I was actually just expecting to be like a, a menu that you go through if you go in here. Uh, there's no getting around it. People who hum in public are just plain creepy. My hobby is going on news shows and pretending to be an expert in whatever they're talking about. It's worth noting that I got up this morning. <laughs> Fair enough. Some people have small gardens behind their houses just to grow new ooblets. Mine's in front of my house. By looks like it's using that gummy thing I had. So let's uh, can we talk to her? Double. Why, why do we go that way? They say if you have a job, you'll love. You'll never need to take a vacation. I really need a vacation. Dang. Trade. You don't have anything I want to buy. Why did you just teleport behind me? How about this place with the giant scissors on it? What can I do here? Hi there. Sorry. Hi. I'm Crispy. I just moved into town. Nice, nice. So yeah, I'm, I'm Patrick. I run the hair salon. Well, barbershop, I guess. Nice meeting you. What's that? Look. Uh, hairdo concept number 28. Inverted frontage with uh, striated elevation planes. Okay. Alright, we're gonna take a quick break. Be right back.